Hey everybody, Johan Magnussen here, Big Sweet Barbecue, and today we're making Iberico Pluma Street Tacos on the Artiflame. So we got two beautiful Spanish Iberico Plumas here, and normally I like to grill these whole, but for these street tacos, I'm gonna cube them up, we're gonna skewer them to maximize the amount of sear and caramelization we will put on these babies. We need to trim some of the silver skin off the Iberico Plumas, then we're gonna cut them into decent sized chunks. Now we wanna season them with a carne asada seasoning. We're using Malcolm's Reed Grande Gringo. Then we wanna thread them onto skewers and then they're ready for the grill. So the Iberico skewers are now ready. The plancha is sitting at a temperature of about 420 degrees. We're gonna add another log to the fire and then let's get to grilling. First, we need to oil the plancha, and then we're gonna add one finely sliced yellow onion. We're gonna add about two cups of finely sliced heirloom tomatoes. We also need to add two finely diced bell peppers. We're also gonna add about two cups of corn kernels. Then we wanna cook these until they got a good char and they're cooked through. We wanna season them halfway with our Big Sweet Barbecue Badass Veggie Boots. When the veggies are almost done, it's time to put the pluma skewers on the grill. And now we wanna grill the plumas until they reach an inner temperature of about 145 degrees. We also wanna add a couple of flour tortillas and just quickly heat them up. So the veggies are cooked, the Iberico pluma is sitting at a good temperature. So now it's time to remove everything from the grill and start building the Iberico pluma street tacos. We're gonna start by spreading some guacamole on the tortillas. Then we're gonna add plenty of the corn and bell pepper mix. Next, we wanna add some of that beautiful caramelized onion. And then we're gonna add plenty of pieces of the grilled Iberico pluma. We wanna to top the pluma with some of the grilled heirloom tomatoes. And then we're gonna drizzle this with a lime jalapeno salt. And last but not least, add a couple of cilantro leaves as well. And then these beautiful Iberico pluma tacos are ready to serve. And that is how I make my Iberico pluma street tacos on the Art of Flame. And I think the only thing left to do is to try these and see what they taste like. And look at that, they look amazing. And the key to eating street tacos is to tilt the head and not the taco. So here we go. Mm. Wow, that is so good. I hope you try it at home. Happy grilling.